Tonight, a war of words brewing over bingo in Jefferson County. Sheriff Mark Petway effectively saying shutting down electronic bingo halls isn't worth his department's time or money. Josh Gann is now live at the sheriff's office with the new developments tonight. Josh. Yeah, Catherine, Attorney General Steve Marshall is hoping local law enforcement enforces the laws when it comes to illegal electronic bingo halls. Marshall tells us his office is ready to step in if need be. A handful of electronic bingo operations are now open in Jefferson County. The latest is Spin It and Win It Charity Bingo in Graysville. Attorney General Steve Marshall says Alabama law is clear when it comes to e-bingo. The court uh, has on multiple occasions demonstrated that bingo itself is something played on a card with people present competing against one another. And any effort to call what is otherwise a slot machine, an electronic bingo machine, is simply trying to skirt the criminal law and the civil law of the state. Four people have received bingo permits in Graysville. This includes Bruce Petway, who Mayor Julio Davis says is the brother of Jefferson County Sheriff Mark Petway. Marshall sent Sheriff Petway a letter in mid-March saying the sheriff's role is to enforce the law and it's the court's role to interpret it. In response, the sheriff is deferring to local law enforcement to enforce the law. He also says electronic bingo is a misdemeanor crime and feels it's too expensive to use resources to prosecute it. Attorney General Marshall tells us if the sheriff doesn't act, his office is ready to step in. It's my hope, again, the sheriff does his job, and that's to be able to enforce the law in Jefferson County. Uh, second, uh, we have the ability, uh, because of the laws of the state of Alabama, for the attorney general to act. We're prepared to act to stop illegal activity. A defiant sheriff, Mark Petway, releasing a new statement tonight, harshly critical of the attorney general. Petway saying Steve Marshall has been, quote, strangely silent about Jefferson County's violent crime and poverty. Petway also says he wishes he had as much time to focus on misdemeanor crimes as the attorney general appears to have. Now, a PR firm representing uh, Sheriff Mark Petway avoiding our question tonight about Graysville mayor's claim that Petway's brother is receiving a bingo permit. Of course, we'll stay on top of it. In Birmingham tonight, I'm Josh Kent, WPRC, Fox 6 News on your side.